Hi, it's Tim from Booth Events. In this video, we're going to take a look at something new that we've added in the app, which is the ability to take photos directly with the camera instead of having to tell the app to take the photos through the camera. So here I've got a Canon M50, and it's connected to my iPad, which is running Booth Events through USB. So let's go ahead and launch this event here. And you can see I've got the live view from this camera here. So now if I go ahead and I take a picture of our amazing office like so, you can see the app immediately responds to receiving the photo, grabs that photo from the camera, and now it still gives you a choice if you have multiple templates assigned to the event for which template to use. If you just have one template assigned, it won't give you the choice. So let's go ahead and choose this one here. And of course, we still have the ability to use Scene Select, which is AI background removal. I'm not going to use it this time. And bang, I can then send my photo anywhere I want. And these are the actions that are configured for the event. If I want to, I can turn these off so that I just have a Save button or a Reshoot button. And that makes it really simple if I just want to quickly take lots of photos, as opposed to if I'm in a Roamer situation where I'm walking around with a Roamer photo booth, and now people want that photo, so I need to enter their, their text or email. So let's go ahead and hit Done. And now, the second time that you come through the, the flow, the app recognizes, hey, last time you did it, you did it with a, a camera driving that photo process, so you probably don't want those big buttons in the way. You'd probably rather see more of the live view. So it gets that white thing out of the way, and these buttons are still there. You can still use them, and if you use them, it'll go back to how it was. But the idea is that now I can continuously take more photos and keep going through that process, and I don't have to wait. Um, I don't have to have that stuff in the way while I'm doing it. Okay, so let's take a look at another application of where this is really useful. So one thing that some people don't know is that Booth Events runs really well on your iPhone. Now, here I've got my iPhone connected with just a USB adapter from Apple directly to my camera. And now you can see I've got the live feed right on my iPhone. So if you can imagine, I can now put these two together in a physical contraption and walk around the venue and actually interact with guests and use this as a roaming photo booth. So here I've just got the original flow. And again, you can see those buttons get small again. So we think this is a really great way for shooting on the go if you have these two things put together somehow in a, in a, in a Roamer-like device, and then you can immediately walk around and get shots of all the things that you want, and you can then either directly interact with guests on the spot, or if this is for a studio application, you wouldn't be doing any of that kind of stuff. You'd just be saving the photos directly. Anyway, this is new. This is now available on the App Store. We hope you love it. We can't wait to see what you do with it. Thanks for watching.